Hey guys, it's Verst Apollo, back with a new game called Blank Dream. I know absolutely nothing about this game, but my friend said it was pretty interesting, so I'm gonna give it a try. Thinking back, it was a boring life. I wouldn't say it was entirely devoid of enjoyment. But if you asked whether I'd live the same life again, I'd absolutely refuse, without a doubt. In fact, if I had to say, I've come to hate it all. I wish my life had never existed, more or less. And so, I, Mishiro Usui, never having a 17th birthday, threw myself into this lake. Oh. Oh, okay. Where is this? What was I just... Right. Right as the girl regained consciousness, she realized she didn't remember who she was. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, okay. What is this? Oh. Yeah, mirror. The mirror shows no reflection. I saw that. The girl sees herself in the mirror. <laughs> Hello, me. I am you, and you are me. It's a mirror. Obvious, right? Oh, I've lost my memories. Right. Don't worry me. I know how to get them back. Now look into the eyes of your reflection. Okay. A familiar place appeared before the girl's eyes. Oh. Things. School bag rests on the desk. The note- the- girl took out a notebook from it. Kikunomiya Academy, class 1-2, Mishiro Usui. Her picture is on the cover. A familiar computer. The girl unconsciously went to power it on, but stopped. The girl felt an unconscious urge to sleep here. The teddy bear stares with round eyes. The girl felt that this bear was very important to her. The cabinet is full of accessories. The girl felt that they all matched her tastes. The closet is packed with black clothes, clothes with frills. The girl felt she'd like to wear these, wear clothes like this. A familiar dresser. The girl felt makeup wasn't worth the effort. It won't open. Okay. A small knife is in the desk drawer. It felt familiar in the girl's hand. The girl got a knife. Cool. Uh, okay. Whoa. Okay. Can I leave now? Nope. Is there... Oh. No! Why would I do that? No! Stop it! I probably have to, don't I? Is there something? No? No, 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 okay. Fuck you too. Okay, let's, let's do it. I don't like this.
Did I? What the fuck? The girl came to you again. Stand, or the girl came to you again standing before the mirror. Though she still felt a vigorous feeling in her hands, there was no trace of the knife of a knife room wound. Welcome back. How did it feel killing yourself in the mirror? What's with that look? You got a problem? Come on. I taught you how to get your memories back. Huh. Uh, Mishiro Usui, 16. I drowned myself in the lake. See? Only partial, but you remembered. Remembered your name and how you died. Look for the mirrors in this world, and then break them. All across this world are mirrors with your reflection. They reflect your memories. And you, s and you see how to break them, right? Just finish yourself off in the mirror. Break the mirrors. You'll get back your memories, and at the same time, grant your wish. Once you break all your mirrors, you'll have you'll have it all back. You can realize your wish. That's the way. That's the way it works. My wish. Got it. Don't just look. You have to break them. That's what granting your wish entails. Why is that, you ask? Remember that part of. Remember that part yourself. Now find the mirrors. I don't remember why it came to that. But I remember that strong wish I had. To make it so my life never even existed. Just as Mishiro regained a piece of her memory, she felt as if she lost something important. Well, that's fucked up. That's super fucked up. I don't know how I feel about this game. I don't know. I I don't know how I feel about this game at all. Where is this? Huh? Are you new here? Maybe. Whoa! I picked one heck of a move or a moment to be here. Who are you? Oh, sorry, sorry. Here, I'm getting all here. I am getting all excited. You just came to this world, right? So I'll bet you're confused. I'm Yuzu. I'm sure you can't remember your name, but don't fret. Everybody is like that at first. I can remember. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's very polite of you. Wait, you do know your name? That's weird. It took me so long for me to remember my name. Where is this? This is known as the Mirror World. It seems to be a world for souls with strong wishes or attachments. I think it's one of the one of those places between life and the afterlife, maybe. I just found myself here one day, so I can't tell you anything concrete. Souls with strong wishes? But the weird thing is, while I remember having died with some strong wish, I can't actually remember what that wish I can't actually remember that wish. You have any ideas, Mishido? I remember my wish. What? You remember your wish? And you know how to grant it? Hold up, Mishido. How blessed are you? Gosh, the world's not fair, even in death. Well, anyway, if you're going to walk around, be careful of the evil spirits wandering here. Of course. You know, no game is complete without evil spirits. Because they'll be jealous of your soul. You can grant their wish, no doubt. Oh. Okay. So, this game is really interesting and very, very weird, and I don't know how I feel about it. There are a lot of doors, I don't know which one I want to go first. What is this? Realm of Love, now a war of the dead. Realm of blood, bathe in it if you 
wish and go mad. That sounds not fun. Let's not do that. Oh, it's for the door. Realm of spirits, on the wind sounds tragedies, end and beginning. Okay. Realm of beauty, for whom does the brush dance? Okay. Realm of greenery, let that meeting be the light of hope, or let that meeting be a light of hope. Realm of death, no life can live before a distorted wheel. Oh, and that's the realm of love. I'm gonna go in this one. Oh. I guess I'm not going in that one. Um, can I go in this one? What was this one? Oh, I can go in this one. Decorative axes on the display. Take one. Cool. I'm gonna... Okay. Oh, okay. Don't do that. Decorative swords on display. Okay. I, I would rather you not do that to me. Let's save. Probably get out. What is that sound? That's ah, locked. Is it locked? Nope. Oh. The watchman is a fool who can only judge by number. Can't he at least tell the real thing from a fake? I don't know what that means. I'm a, I'm a stay away from that. Cause I feel like this is some puzzles and shit, and puzzles are not my forte. And that oh, more creepy stuff. Cool. There's a teddy bear. I don't know how I feel about that teddy bear. What is this shit? It's so creepy. Like, I, I would never think that- Oh, hey, fireplace. Let's go to that. I would never think that a game like this would be creepy. This game is really creepy. The fireplace quietly lights up the room. Okay. That's cool. I guess I'll go talk to the bear then. Hello, bear. The teddy bear stares with round eyes. Cute. Cool. Um. I guess I'll leave then. I don't know what that was all about. But. It seems that I am all out of time for this episode. So. I will see you all. So you guys. Next time. And hopefully I'll figure out what this shit is. Yeah, I don't know. Some weird stuff. Yeah. Alright, I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye.